Hi, how's it going? Adam McChesney here. Thank you for coming to my YouTube channel today. As always, we appreciate your support. Be sure to subscribe to the channel by clicking the link so that way you can get notified each and every single time we release a video. And also share our content with your friends. We'd love to chat with other people that are looking for tips on digital marketing and just entrepreneurship and business in general. We really appreciate the support and love pouring value into to you each and every single week. In today's video, I'm gonna to talk to you about how I grew my digital marketing agency over the course of 15 months from basically starting at zero to seven figures in that short period of time. With the one key component of, of how we've been able to grow that without doing paid ads at all has been personal branding. So two years ago, I joined a group, a network, a mastermind called Apex, which is ran by Ryan Stuman. And in that program, he teaches us how to build our machine and become the authorities within, their, within our market. And so over the course of the last two years, I've been producing content each and every single day on social media and platforms like uh, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, you name it, I've been doing it. I've obviously created this YouTube channel. I started a podcast. I've been speaking on stages and being guests on other podcasts as well to be able to get my story and my brand and my company out there. The biggest issue with people that are in businesses like digital marketing and in most industries today is that we are just a commodity. And that's unfortunate, but it's also fortunate because it gives us opportunity to be able to become the brand that we know we can be. And so over the last two years, we've seen exponential growth. Like I mentioned, we went from essentially doing zero dollars in revenue to doing seven figures in 15 months without any ad spend in terms of acquiring clients. And that seven figure dollar mark that we've been able to do in our agency does not have ad spend tied to it. So we are one of the fastest growing agencies that are out there and we've been able to do it because of personal branding. And so a lot of our clients, even though I'm based here in St. Louis, are all across the country. I've met with them via Zoom, phone call, et cetera. I've now met with a lot of them in person, whether it be in other coaching groups, masterminds, networking events, et cetera. But I've been able to connect with business owners differently than most digital marketers. The reason why digital marketing has a bad taste in a lot of people's mouth, business owners per se, is because there's so much spam, cold email, and all of this trashy sales pitch environment that you see in digital marketing. People are cold DMing people, they're spamming, they're doing literally everything just to acquire clients. They're also over promising and under delivering on whatever it was that they sold. And so the way that I've been able to kind of bridge that gap is producing content each and every single day with 90% of it really having nothing to do with digital marketing. And that's completely different than most digital marketers. If you go to most digital marketer social media platforms, especially Facebook, you're gonna see the traditional banner, I can guarantee you 20 to 30 new jobs a month in the next 30 days, and then you're just gonna see cold pitch after cold pitch after cold pitch. I spend 90% of my time producing content talking about entrepreneurship, talking about business, talking about life in general as an entrepreneur, and I have fun with it. And I'm connected with a lot of business owners that they resonate with that because they realize that I'm actually a human and I'm not just trying to sell them. We have so many people interested in doing business with us. A lot of them are not ideal clients. They might either already be in a good position. They might not have the budget that makes sense to actually hire a marketing agency, or we just might not be able to help them for that particular service that they're looking for. Or they might be in an industry where we just don't feel like we're the best fit to be able to work with them. And I'm upfront about that. And so was my entire team. And so we've been able to gain a lot of trust in the market because of that as well. We get tagged in Facebook groups and referred all of the time by other marketing people, by our current clients, people in my network, because they know that we're gonna be true to our word and if we can help someone, we're gonna tell them that. But also if we can't help someone, we're gonna let them know as well. But by not just pitching and doing the same stuff as every other digital marketer that's out there, 
I've been able to really connect with these business owners and if whether or not they need to utilize our services or not right now, at some point they likely will. And so I've had people that I've been connecting with over the last two years that are now coming back and being like, hey Adam, now it's finally time. We're finally in a position or our contract ended with our last company. Now we wanna work with you because they've been seeing my stuff and I've been putting in the work day in and day out over the last two plus years. And so as I'm talking to a bunch of these business owners, especially digital marketers that are like, hey Adam, I just don't understand how you've been able to grow in the facet that you have. I tell them to you know, look at what I've been doing and they might try it for 30 days, 90 days, six months, what have you, and be like, hey, it's just not clicking. Well, the story is, is that it took me six to nine months before this content stuff and this personal brand really took off. So people that have been seeing me for the year plus plus are like, Adam, how did this happen? Did it happen overnight? Well, of course not. No one goes back and looks at two plus years when no one was liking my stuff, when no one knew who I was and no one really cared, right? And so now that it's all coming into fruition, people are starting to ask questions. They're starting to, to pick my brain and things like that. So I love talking with people about personal branding and how we've been able to grow a very competitive company in a very competitive market of digital marketing, being completely different from a branding standpoint, starting from me at the top. So if you have any questions about personal branding, if you are interested in learning more about what my process looks like, feel free to leave a comment below or reach out to me on social media. You can also go to my website at adammcchesney.com. Thank you so much for watching today's video and we'll see you next time.